Credit unions are for everyone, and they're for everyone for a reason. If we don't have wealthier members of society, we can't lend to anyone. They are mutuals and cooperatives. They are run professionally, and they're owned completely by their savers and borrowers. The only people who talk about the poor person's bank are credit union people. So I think we have to change our message. I think we have to get smarter about how we sell credit unions and who we sell credit unions to. If we don't engage the whole community, we can't help people with fewer financial choices. I think that credit unions represent a means by which uh, we can uh, provide the micro credit that helps people actually get into production and get things moving. I believe that they're the real crowdfunding mechanism of the future. The difference with banks, the difference is longer between them and credit unions is we want to help people, they want to make money out of it, simple as that. Credit unions have got to recognise that they are part of the financial services industry. Other than they wake up to the fact that there are competitors, sharks in their custard, so to speak, they will never, never grow and survive. The need for credit unions to work with their supporters, with their providers of their services, seem to be missing. That In the credit union movement in Britain, there isn't the strength yet um, of that kind of collaborative action. The, the problem is, is developing the credit unions to be independent of government funding um, and to grow into a large organisation so that they're, they're self-funding and become really good businesses in the mutual sector. I think that's where QS UK comes in, bringing other partners to the table that we can learn from, as well as buy products and services and get economies of scale. QSO UK is the first organisation since 1999 that is aiming to bring together credit unions, vendors to credit unions, credit union practitioners, credit unions themselves and credit union bodies because they're all mutually dependent. An organisation like QSO coming on and providing the resources and the training for credit unions, we might be able to um, help the, the, the movement grow stronger. I suppose all aspects of the credit union development, the products and services need to develop, and the membership growth, uh, again, is something that we're looking at doubling or tripling in the next couple of years. People need to cooperate more and then we can all come together and have the credit unions running on good systems and bringing value to everybody. Well, as a service provider, it's important for our success to work closely with credit unions so that we can refine the products and make sure we deliver exactly what they need. All credit unions have websites, all of them have marketing needs, all of them have, there's a whole lot of providers telephones and computer systems, etc. The, the needs of credit unions, especially as they grow larger, are more and more. The importance of something like QSO for credit unions is going to be absolutely amazing. And we are supposed to be cooperatives. We heard today that we don't always cooperate as well as we should. Having a formal structure to enable us to do that, I think, will make a difference. We've not had that formal structure before in bringing credit unions together under one umbrella. What we're trying to do is provide a mechanism by which we can know much more about what is possible um, and improve the choices available to credit unions and um, make those, those choices more sustainable. Yeah, it's having, having the systems and products to be able to run your credit union efficiently from a, a manpower point of view and also from the point of view of uh, being able to make sure the funds are secure and you're meeting the regulations of the PRA and SCA. It's uh, the collective wisdom of the thousands of people who are actively involved in building the credit union movement and just trying to figure out what will help them make their life easier. It's vital that we work with people to help people and it doesn't matter what your political views are behind that on something like this, we would be quite happy to join it.